Welcome back guitar friends. Today's video is about thumb technique. The thumb is a stout but agile member of the finger family, mainly used to strum chords and to play bass notes. You've been using the thumb a lot already in this course for your strums and arpeggios, so you're not a stranger to the technique, but what our goal today is to refine your technique so you are a little bit faster and a little bit more accurate and a little better sounding. So we begin with the same hand position we've been using up to this point. Your fingers are resting on the treble strings in a ready to play position and your thumb is resting on the bass in a ready to play position. The changes will be in the beginning of the stroke. We want to feel the bass string with the tip of the thumb before you actually stroke it. So that means placing the middle part of your nail on the string right before you actually stroke it, or if you don't have a nail, the tip of the flesh. When you actually follow through, it's very short, about a half, less than a half inch. In fact, very close to a quarter inch. The reason we don't want to follow through inch or, uh, an inch or two is because it pulls you too far from the bass strings and it takes longer to get back and that will slow down the speed of your play. So short follow through in the plane of the strings and you want to pluck at a right angle. The reason for that is if you go at a diagonal you make that scrape which is unpleasant to hear and mics pick it up really well if you're being miked. You want to make sure your movement when you stroke the thumb comes from the large joint here on the palm. That gives you lots of leverage when you want to play loud. What we don't want is to move a segment of the thumb because that's weak, not much volume possible, and also you tend to scrape on the nail very easily. We divide the work up between the thumb and fingers like this. Bases are played by the thumb. Trebles are played by the fingers. Up next, a demonstration of the player's view of the thumb and how it interacts with the fingers. <laughs> 